My main account in Skyblock has over 5,600 hours in playtime, and after two years of not playing on it seriously, I decided to come back and continue. In today's video, we're gonna see how much money we have. At 711, at 40 bill, this is where we are, 711, 40 bill with everything that we have. Then the amount that we're actually gonna use. You guys are convincing me now, maybe I should keep the game breakers and then I just leave it in, I mean, cause that is like actual legitimate net worth, you know what I mean? Yeah, we'll keep the game breaker stacks in the personal vault, it'll count for my net worth. And then find out our true skyblock level. My level has gone up a bit, 287. I mean, I don't know what I've done. I've only taken things out of my inventory and put them in chests and somehow my level's going up. So we're at 287 right now. Once that's set in stone, we're gonna try my favorite activity in the game and see how much money we can make. Like I'm technically one tapping it. The venom and the fire aspect that I have on it kills it over time. And if we need any upgrades, we'll be adding it to our wall of goals. Well, I'm pretty hyped being back on the main profile. No restrictions, just fun. And does that mean I'll be uploading more? Well, that's the plan. Coming back onto the main account, I realized that my frames were trash and that if I was going to regularly upload, I needed to change some things. But yeah, bro, this whole bottom portion, I tried to just get rid of it. Cause usually when I try and record, bro, like this legs me so much because I'm usually all the way up here and it just renders the whole thing. So it just makes recording such a lengthy process. So we're gonna have to get rid of this. Before mapping out the demolition plan with the island, I felt like organizing my account first would be the better priority. I'm sure you guys watching right now want to know, how much money does Verlo really have? And how much is he gonna count towards this new journey moving forward? Bro, look at the amount of pets I have. For some reason, I just can't let go of just any pet that has like a skin on it. But for the sake of just keeping things clean, I'm gonna make sure that I have no duplicates. I think the one thing that I will keep as a duplicate is the golden dragon, because you gotta keep one just in case you're leveling or doing like some sorrel grinding or anything for combat, you know? For the most part, this is, this is it. This is it. We are at 336 pet score. Pet skins, exotics, and other rare items are a huge part of my investment and collector portfolio, but because I know it's unlikely for me to sell it, I don't think it's really fair for me to count it as net worth for these following reasons. One, I have so many unapplied skins. I feel like I've given this rundown a bunch of times, but I mean, these four chests are absolutely full of every single skin that's been released. I mean, there's even more chests that go down there. Uh, even like the super OG ones. I mean, not a full row, but I mean, you guys get to just, just look at it. I got everything, man, everything. Two, I have too many exotic sets. I mean, these are the exotic armor. I mean, if you wear it, it's just like strong armor. Obviously, it doesn't look like this, and it's all cool and dark blue. And I got a bunch of these exotic pieces everywhere and in separate chests. And it's just, I got a lot. And it would be very hard to calculate the net worth of this. Three, I have too many investment items. And this is a crazy issue because I would have to fit all of these items in my storage and I can't because I have so many items. I actually tried to do this and I peaked at number seven on the net worth leaderboards. So I would have no space in my storage when trying to play and I wouldn't really sell these items anyway. And because I'm so high up in the leaderboards, there would be no fun in climbing just to try and take over six people. I also think this will make it more enjoyable for you guys to watch, having more realistic items like a Hyperion or getting a Claymore, rather than three full dubs of Grand Freezing Rune skins rotting in a backpack, counting as crazy net worth. You guys are convincing me now, maybe I should keep the Game Breakers and then I just leave it in, I mean, because that is like actual legitimate net worth, you know what I mean? Yeah, we'll keep the Game Breaker stacks in the personal vault, it'll count for my net worth. My level has gone up a bit, 287. I mean, I don't know what I've done. I've only taken things out of my inventory and put them in chests and somehow my level's going up. So we're at 287 right now. Everything that we need here at the bottom for farming, we have everything at the top here, either for foraging or fishing. And if it's not up to date right now, cause maybe like there's better armor and there's better stuff, like that's just, just gonna be a part of the series. That's just gonna be a part of the grind. Now we just gotta figure out what our skyblock level is and where we are in the leaderboard and our net worth leaderboard. And then we roll out the new intro. My global ranking, I'm 6,488.
Before moving on to the grind, I wanted to quickly go over on how I added some nice finishes on my appreciation wall. I also made a wall that I can write my goals on and some grass flooring to keep the simplicity of the island. Right. Once I was finished decorating, I felt like exploring some old money making methods and one of my favorites back in the day used to be soil grinding. So that's exactly where I went. Oh, somebody just left. I don't know if you guys just saw that, but bros, I think, do people still macro uh, sorrows? Is that a thing? Do people still macro that? Bro, I seen someone for like a split second. I'm gonna see if I can go back and like replay that. Like I'm technically one tapping it. The venom and the fire aspect that I have on it kills it over time. Ooh, what a mile at me. Wait, I just spawned my tier five rev horror here. Bro, how the hell did I just spawn my... Bro, fuck a wee ball. Bro, what the fuck? Bro, I'm about to die. I'm about to get fried. Yo, listen, we're sorrow grinding and we're farming Slayer XP. Lobby is so laggy. I can't access my menu. I think I go golden drag. I don't know what you're supposed to bro. I, I need an expert to tell me. Oh my god, 800k. Oh. Oh my god, I'm hitting 800k right now. I don't want to leave either, bro. I'm afraid that I'm going to have to try and like out compete this guy, but I think this guy's content with like taking half the mobs right now. disconnected i'm gonna be yeah there it is so unfortunate it keeps disconnecting him look how fast the, my internet like comes back up too see look at that look at, like five seconds bro yeah it's like everything's just packed i disconnected and i feel like any lobby that i join i'm just griefing somebody man i think it's i think it's kind of i think it's kind of done but we're gonna sell what we have and i don't think it's gonna be much but uh, we made 15, yeah, we made about 16 mil. Not bad. You know what? All the money that I make today, I'm just going to keep in my purse. So we've made 17.6 mil so far today. It's crystal dyed, all white. Looks a little swaggy. Put it over here. Look what it looks. Look what it looks like right here. Here we go. Grand freezing rune. All right, let's see if this was worth it. Oh my god, that looks so clean. Oh my god, that looks so clean. Nah, that was a W cop. Nah, that was a W cop. Taking out my crystal white storm set and applying a grand freezing rune on it had me in the mood to kill some mobs. I decided to take a deeper look into some skyblock levels and start my bestiary grind early. Oh, wait, the overall progress 51%? So 10k and then it maxes out? That's like pretty... Easy, I think. I, I, I don't know. I feel like that's pretty that's pretty easy. We have 5,000 kills and we max it out at 10k? There I go. I got it. Bizarre. I think this costs a crap ton too, right? Wow. It would cost me 321 mil. I'm pretty sure these were way cheaper back then too. This is like definitely... Like if, you, if you guys are on a new account... Or just want something to do or you guys need combat exp bro this is a great combat exp bro s tier if you're starting off i think there was like that one moment when you join skyblock and you find it fun at first uh you encounter like your first grind and then it kind of like repels you off the game a little bit but some people like that aspect of the game you know especially iron man people i'm telling you i hate twerking it on me you twerking it on me you twerking it on me you can't be distracting me you can't be distracting me all right, we gotta go back to the grind. A little screenshot. A little screenshot won't hurt. I do enjoy this though. Maybe it's the fact that I'm like I'm, I'm back on the main profile and I can just do whatever I want. I like the uh, I like the freedom. Uh, we need to kill 300 more, and then I'll be able to show you guys. Once I kill 300 more, I should be able to show you guys how much money I've made from 5,000 to 7.5k. So. If I just hit it once, does it count as a kill? Hopefully I don't gotta finish it. Because there it is. I got the beastary level up. Woo! There it is. Almost gonna be maxed out. I just need 2.5k. Another but I basically gotta kill another 2.5k and then I'm done with the ice rocker collection. So I don't know if I should count the blue jerry boxes because I, I feel like this is like a bit unrealistic. So we won't count these. But I mean this is all the armor that we have here and the glacite jewels. I mean, is this really even worth anything? I basically got two to three mil off that. And if I were to sell the glacier, bro, 10 mil in glacite jewels, 54. 
And I would say this probably took me roughly about an hour, an hour and a half. So, uh, dude, this is such a fire skin right here. The grand searing rune is so respectable, dude. Or do you like mine? Oh man, we twinning. Bro, I'm I don't know how people are hating on the grand freezing rune. I bro, I arguably think like depending on how you style it, like they're both fire. A little bit of a little bit of renovations going on. Nothing nothing super crazy, but a little bit of renovations going. Ah, I mean I guess I'll just place it right here. I don't know where else to place it, but we bought the uh the two new cakes. This is kind of bothering me just a tad bit, so you know what? I'm gonna I'm gonna fix this really quick. All right, there we go. It looks nice. This is nice and complete. So that way there's like no random gap in the wall. I tried a sorrel grind before, but got caught up with not only the spooky festival, but with bad internet. I came back and tried out a quick 30 minute test to see if it was really worth my time. I go to the bazaar. And if I wanted to quick sell this, we're looking at around three mil. Okay, so it's been 20 minutes. It seems like we're keeping up with like the 700 K XP per hour. Um, I have like a small little crowd here. I'm doing a little thug shaker dance. We're looking at five mil. Yeah, we're looking about five mil. It seems like every 10 minutes I get 2.5 mil, which is like, uh, it's not that bad. We're quickly doing a little detour too. I saw the message at the bottom that there was a powdered gas and I believe I have like 43 kills right now. And if I want to max out the beast theory, it's 200 kills. And if I look now, Oh, we have, yeah, we have 44. One step at a time, one step at a time. So in 30 minutes, we've made 8.5 mil. And uh, I'm pretty sure I can literally make double that mining, uh, just like regular Ruby or something. But this was one of my favorite things to do. Unfortunately, there's like a bunch of things that I still need to upgrade. I mean, look at this, bro. Glistening brown belt, brown. For the Ice Walkers, we still need to kill 2,500 more, so. I'm just gonna start tackling that and um, I'm gonna cross out ice walkers from the beast theory list because it seems like we have everything else on this. I mean, I mean, not really, but I mean, we'll chop it down one at a time. That took us maybe like 10 minutes or so. Nice 3.5, bro. I feel like I'm getting more money doing this than, <laughs> than sorrows. We are at 800 now. Oh, 1.7K to go. I, I gotta grind another 1,500 of these, and I'll never be here again, bro. <laughs> and another ghast. I think these spawn like what, like once every 20 minutes or so? Wonder if this information's like open on the wiki, and I'm missing every single shot. Just throw that in there. I'm doing some treasure hoarders now. I mean, they're pretty easy to kill, and they're all within like the same spot, just like the ice walkers. I mean, I did maybe like two or three little sweeps and. I've already gone up a couple tiers. Uh, it looks like I'm gonna have to kill 4,000 of these and I've killed 24 so far. Like I barely grinded treasury hoarders on the main account. So this is gonna be a fresh grind. I actually, I don't know. I don't know if I wanna start this. It'd be nice if I did this in a different video so that way I can actually test out per hour how much this would be. But um, yeah, you know what? I'll do this a different time. Bro, I'm getting so distracted. So there was another guy that came into my lobby here and look at him, man. Look at this guy go. Level nine. Like, what am I gonna do? Try and grief this guy? Like, oh my God. And he, look at him, he's whacking away. So, I mean, I ran over here and there's some goblins. And if I look at the goblin beast area here, I have to kill 25,000 of them and I've only killed 10K. So I'm gonna be here for a while. Now, I'm thinking, right? Do I just stand here and just chill out? And I mean, can I abuse this? I mean, it's definitely not bannable, but what if I just pulled out a bow pet? And isn't there like a little spot that I can just like sit right here and just chill? Yeah, I was gonna say like, maybe if this was viable, maybe, but this is like, this has to be the laziest way ever. Like there's no, there's like actually no way that I'm gonna commit to this by using the battle pet in AFK. So that's just a no go. I'd rather just hype around. I feel like I'd be able to complete it like 30 times faster. So I did the goblin raid, I'm not gonna lie. It was uh, pretty satisfying being able to just one tap everything. And if you look at the bottom, I killed 260 out of 25 goblins and they only spawned a thousand. So uh, we'll take it, we'll take it. Some free juice. So I'll give you guys a little update on how close I am to finishing these ice walkers. I am, I got 800, 850 to go. 
Less than 400 kills. 360 left. Oh my gosh, we just finished. Bro, this guy up here was giving me the utmost competition. But he's on an Iron Man, so I gotta respect it. But we maxed it out. Look at it. Overall progression. Max 10k. Oh, what a grind. But I mean, it's complete. GG's. Okay, so so far we've made 61 mil all today. 61 mil, which is absolutely beautiful. I mean, coming back, progressing the account, and not really chasing money like crazy. I'll take 61 mil any day. And we have 17 bill to spend. I'm probably not going to spend all of it, but oh my gosh. A good day's work, man. A good day's work. I'll take it.